Hi, it's Charlotte, Etiquette Connoisseur, and I'm entering the challenge with Kel from If It Ain't Cheap, I'm Not Buying It, and Leah from Junkernecker. So if you guys would like to see more of this table setting and how I laid out the rest of the room vignette, please keep watching. So I'm here to find some things to go with the theme, pearls and lace. And uh, I'm here at my china closet looking around to see what uh, dishes I'm going to use. So I was really excited about this challenge and I was in my china closet looking for some things to go together and I thought, well, pearls and lace seem like dessert to me because when you add pearls and lace to any outfit or to any room decor, it seems like it's dessert. So here I am finding my crystal dishes and I'm going to use this on the table as the chargers for the glasses and that table I painted and that's the rest of it there it's really a long oval table but I took out the two long parts in the center and maybe I can use that as a screen when I want to hide something but back to the dishes so these are four lovely dishes that I have had for quite some time and I thought they would look lovely along with my white and gold plates. These I would use to put a little dessert on and I was thinking what am I going to do? Where am I going to find some lace? So I stepped over to my dining room. Here I find my wine glasses that I'm going to choose four to put the ice cream in. I'm setting a place for four. So here I find four plastic champagne flutes. I packed away my glass champagne flutes earlier because I may be moving very soon. I got these from the dollar store. They came two in a pack and I thought they looked really good with my glassware, the wine glasses. Now I'm going to find some cloth napkins to go with the glassware and these look pretty nice. I like these cream ones. I found some gold napkin rings. I like those silver cloth napkins there but I think I prefer the cream with the embroidery. So let's see what else. <gasps> Look what I found. I found some lace curtains with some satin and fringe on the end. And I happened to find these in my living area. And I thought they would look really really pretty in uh, my breakfast room they're pretty long so I'm gonna use them both to dress the room I found these brackets and boxes and a pedestal so I'm gonna use these to accentuate the room and this three tier stand and the flowers so now I'm going to dress the room, the table, 
with the lace and the dishes. I'm using the crystal dishes as a charger for the wine glass so that when having the ice cream you place a spoon in the crystal dish and this is a little gold pedestal and a bust that I've had for quite some time and here are the pearls I didn't realize how many pearls I had around my house some baby's breath from my daughter's bouquet for her birthday. I snatched that and now I'm redecorating the lampshade. I have a simple black lamp hanging there, a pendant light, and I put this little skirt. I found this lace skirt. And now the curtains from the living room. I decided to put it in the breakfast room because I just adore how it looks. These two white screens I'm going to place at the edge of the wall just to bring a little bit of interest and the pedestal I'm going to add this white ceiling medallion on top and a three-tier stand goes above it. I thought it looked kind of interesting you can put more desserts but I didn't have any and then I'm going to set up my boxes with the uh, little bracket and flowers and the finial. So I want to show you what I did here. I had this hanging horizontally and uh, the wiring was not right for it to hang vertically so I chose a dollar store um, over the door towel rack and I put it behind the frame and hung it from a tassel. I got some really inexpensive stuff at the dollar store. I got some uh, strawberry sherbet and um, chocolate hazelnut wafers. Because I think strawberry and chocolate goes very well together. The colors I like very much. And these are eclairs from the dollar store. And they taste really good too. My children just love them. I personally make eclair and the recipe I have is uh, from Betty Crocker. My mother always made eclairs for us as children and I learned how to do them but this is just a little substitute for today as I do not have much time. My mother's eclairs are the best in the world. Someday soon when I'm making my eclairs from scratch I'll have you over. How's that? See, there's a little eclair thief right now, stealing my eclairs. Luckily, uh, I have some more. And what uh, goes together with dessert? Champagne. It was my daughter's birthday and she had some champagne left over. So I decided to use it up and voila. So I made this collage a few years ago. It's about Marie Antoinette. I stuck some pieces of uh, paper together 
and it looked like Marie Antoinette at the uh, balcony and it says let them eat cake and then this is a reproduction of uh, Renoir and around the room I put the screen and also this is a Victorian woman at uh, her balcony and the curtains are hanging there with my um, china closet and take a look around the room So this is my pearls and lace table. These are very long necklaces that I've had. And the little piece of lace on the bust, I've always had that there. The small necklace with the cute little mirror came from my eldest son, Wesley. He gave me that as a gift years ago, and I just love it. And this is my share of ice cream, wafers, and eclair. And I'm going to have some champagne with you. Cheers. So I've had these French chairs for years and years. I just love them. Also uh, my china closet. I actually found that china closet in the trash and I painted it over. So please look in the description box and you'll find the other ladies channels. Please support them and please take a look at my channel. Like, comment, subscribe and share. My videos are about etiquette, decorating, crafting and I hope to see you soon. Take care.